Hello, my name is Philippa. Welcome. Um, I would like to share with you today a little bit of what my own uh, guardian dragon has shared with me about them. And uh, these are um, bits of uh, kind of long conversations and they had a context. Um, but I, I took the main uh, points that um, he shared with me, which I thought that um, I could share with you too as well. Okay, so the, the key words, uh, particularly of your own guardian dragon, are transmutation and cleansing, raising intelligence and awareness, uh, and or cleansing and when they are doing this this work you might see colors and he explained to me colors you see or may see signify the alchemy process the alchemic process that is happening thus they may vary as you watch the dragon working and the way that um, I would describe um, the the presence of the guardian dragon for each one of us is more of the equivalent as a warming embrace. Okay, so continuing. We dragons carry different rays of light depending on the dimension that we belong to. We all have different roles, all equally important. The dragon guardian of a person should always be called upon for he, she knows best. The other dragons then come in to offer their energetic qualities. And he explained this to me um, regarding the work that I, I do with people and, and with them. So there are several dragons, but uh, so if you have an appointment with me, your dragon and your personal unicorns and your guardian angel and other guides you may have, they are also included in, in that process, okay? But I thought I would share this uh, uh, with you uh, as well, to know that you can call in your own um, guardian dragon uh, anytime you are even working with other dragons or for whatever reason. And he explains, the guardian dragon does the integration of the energies. So this is one of the reasons, another reason why um, you will eventually always work with your um, guardian dragon. The earth elemental dragons are important to harmonize the space and environment. And this was in the context of uh, when you are uh, helping someone out, the environment, their space, uh, whether work, house, uh, whatever, is also important to take care of that energy. So it was in that context that um, there, it's not just it, it to, that I also uh, work with, with those dragons and you can also as well to help them to clear your space and harmonize the energy of your own space. So if you didn't know that, here's another tip. And another thing he says was, you should ask your dragon the same way you'd ask for help to your guardian angel. The same way, whatever it is, just ask your, your dragon. Another part. Collectively, the dragons are specialists in activations, hence why we approach those who are ready to receive them. And this is something that you might hear a lot from people that work with dragons. You don't approach dragons, dragons approach you. It, that's, that's just because of that. It, uh, if, if they don't approach you, there's nothing wrong with you. It's just that whatever those dragons are or represent you're just not ready for their energy so there is no no approach 
that's that's just what it means so if you go to other dragon then you perhaps get the approach of the other dragon that that's just uh, what it means in the course of evolution which you call ascension collectively we help with inspirations and wisdom slash knowledge whilst the inspirations are felt slash perceived by you and you was me he was talking directly to me as intuitions or ideas it is easier than for you to intellectualize through the mind and manifest them in your physical reality and in your overall energetic state of your life the wisdom we bring is internal that's why you me have difficulty in writing what you see and know about us so he was explaining to me um why is it that i know and i know what i'm doing and i and and i just know what i'm doing and i just know what i know and see but um i i still struggle to explain it um and so he was explaining to me why and i i think this is another thing that it could be useful for you to to know in case you struggle with something similar to this wisdom is born or arises uh, from the heart in the heart which then propagates to the other energetic points this is why you can only express in the best possible way after you have integrated that wisdom so what this means is you may never be able to put all the words into that wisdom that knowledge to verbalize it and to intellectualize it but when you have fully integrated it that's when you will manage to actually exp explain the best you can but that's when you are able to verbalize something about it and finally uh, the last thing taken from a context simply put each activation is a box of wisdom that is gifted to you then i still have another paper sheet and here we go collectively we can clean and transmute dense energies and in the same way that we are divided by our specialties or expertises uh, in the types of activations and wisdom we offer regarding clearing dense energies we also have our own uh, specificities of work such as how dense can we clean what type of energy and so on we cannot slash do not do anything that is against the free will of the person this is why uh, you have to ask okay it's one of the reasons if you want help if you need help if there's anything that you're not figuring out and you don't understand something that is happening or not happening ask and they will guide you to to you to to your answers we can only do what you ask of us inside the divine law of it being for your own good and for the others we can only act sorry we can only act on the divine order and lastly now again this was taken out of uh, a conversation individuality is uniquely used to manifest and express a uniqueness a creativity and a form of divine creation for it is a reflection of divine intelligence and that is uh, all for today um, so the original language was not english so i translated it um, so there might be some words that you would probably use others um, more commonly used in, in English language. I just tried to do uh, the most direct translation possible. Um, 
and I hope that uh, this wisdoms uh, that I shared with you um, made sense and uh, can help you to communicate better with your own um, guardian dragon. Thank you for watching.